is good, right? If you shoot like that, what I would like from this group is that if you see that from anyone, there's immediate bullying. We got to bring that back. You saw a pretty big difference there, right? So the, the themes that we're looking for is the stance, start and stop, feet spread apart, knees bent. You could see when I wanted to leave from here, I got the explosive power and I could really push out of position, right? You need to take the first couple steps about as, about as aggressively as you can move. Now, how many of you have been to a match and you see like the big dudes can sometimes put up some really good times? This is how, it's because Going, going in and out of position is where the time is made. Like aggressive, full power, immediate exit, that's, that's critical. The first couple steps, as aggressive as I can move. Now, I put down red cones for you to glance to. It gives you a visual target. That's a good thing to get in the habit of, not putting red cones on the ground, but looking to a spot that you wanna to go to. So your eyes drive what you're doing in this game. Look at spots I wanna shoot, look reloads into the gun, Look at spots I want to run to. So it's very, very single-minded, you know? Like, I'm done, sh I'm done shooting here. I'm going to look over, and my whole mission in life for a couple of steps is to drive to that red cone. Now, run, run, run till I get close to the red cone, and this is where things get complicated. I now have to do multiple things at once, which is look to where I think the target is or where I can see the target, depending on if I can see it or not. Rebuild my grip as I mount the gun, and then slow down and stabilize into my shooting position. We're gonna do all three of those at one time. What I recommend for that is I get a few steps, depending on you know your size and how you're set up, it'll change the number of steps, but somewhere around here, depending on how big or how powerful you are with your legs, whatever, you're gonna be like, all right, I'm gonna switch to shooting mode now. Then I'm gonna look up to the target where I think it is, two hands come back on the gun, gun goes to where I'm looking, and I'll step into position here like this. What drill does this look like? The one we just did? Yeah, that's why. So just think like you're gonna run, run, run. You get close to where you're shooting again. You'll mount the gun and you'll be slowing yourself down and stabilizing yourself. The cue that works for me is when it's time to slow down, I'll visualize sitting back on my butt and then I'll just let myself take a lot of short choppy steps to slow myself down. So you take long strides when you're running. So if you have a long run on a stage, you should take long strides and be running properly. Short choppy steps help you control speed and direction. So if we're gonna slow down, it'll be just let yourself take more short steps and you'll slow yourself down. Does that make sense? Now, when do you think I should start shooting when I get over here? See, as soon as I see what? See what? Sights on the target, that's what I like. So notice it's not stop, then shoot. It's not as soon as I see the target, oh, shoot. No, no, I'm looking for a small spot on the brown. And when my sight is on that spot, I'm gonna be like, yep, okay, now it's time to shoot. You saw me here, I was shooting before my body was really stabilized, right? That, I mean, you don't have to force that to happen. It's more like in my head, I'm allowing that to happen. It's like, I don't really care that I'm unstable or whatever. If the sight looks good for the target, I'm gonna react to that and start shooting. And that's what we want, okay? Does that make sense to everybody so far? Okay, a few safety things. We have three setups here. You're gonna move from yellow cone to red cone. There should be no conflict. These two guys are moving opposite directions. Uh, we're dividing up the range with the blue cones. Again, there should be no conflict here. Just be aware we're not trying to point our gun up and down the line when we're running. We're gonna point our hips in the direction we're running and point our guns to as downrange as we can. Sound good? All right, same drill on that side. This drill's, like on this side, it's now there'll be some running. All right, let's get to it. <laughs> 